kids. Yeah. Good kids. So yes. therefore, you know why he is. The bean bean gourmet. gourmet. Oh, okay. Yeah. When but did you develop this obsession with beans? Young right Tom? about that time, my mom used to always feed us beans. Right when we were in, she would crush them. <laughs> no, we, no, there was no Gerber for us. She actually crushed the beans for us. And we you had, didn't know as a kid you weren't supposed no, to like them. No, and I love them. We've loved them ever since. They're inexpensive. Beans are high in fiber, low, low in calories, hardly any fat. It, why don't we get? Let me show you what I'm going to make yeah, for you okay. today. This is delicious. Take it's a look at just this. Like Fred. Did huh? your mother love you, Tom? I just want to know. The yes. beans all the time. Yes. Okay. She loved me, and she had eight kids, and she said I was wanted. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> she did. No, she did. I asked her. I asked her last week. Okay. No, really. Anyway, this is the beautiful garbanz. No, seriously, I was wanted. I believe. The last you. one wasn't, but then they loved her. Okay. Uh, I, well. But anyway, this is the garbanzo bean fudge. Anyway, uh, I just want people to know that beans are versatile. They're just not heat and serving out of a can. You can go in any recipe with beans. All right, we'll All show right. you how to make it. Yeah, let's, let me show you how. Yeah, All right. right, the first thing you need are four squares of unsweetened chocolate. Now, mm -hmm. I like the unsweetened kind because we're going to add some sugar to this, so you don't need the bittersweet or anything like we're that. Not just some, add sugar. some sugar. <laughs> <laughs> well, anyway. <laughs> uh, also, we've got uh, one and a half cubes of butter. Uh -huh. Now, now, now that's, that's, what is that, three, uh, what, a quarter and a quarter, a quarter and a half a quarter. Mm -hmm. Don't You're say saying, cubes. People's no, cubes might be One and a half cubes. Sizes. Okay, well, no. No, cubes are this size. This is the cube. This size. <laughs> okay, one cube, that's this a quarter size. Pound. Yeah, a quarter, quarter pound. pound a quarter pound. Plus okay. Half a quarter pound. Right. Next, we've got two pounds of powdered sugar. Tommy, you're kidding. That's, that's the third highest mountain in the state. <laughs> it's not that bad. Do you think there's a little fattening? A little sugar there. All oh, that sugar is going to go in this Yes. Tummy? How come all of a sudden in the kitchen you turn into Mike Wallace? <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> this is just a simple recipe. <laughs> Cut me some slack. <laughs> anyway, next, we've got one teaspoon of vanilla. Now, by the way, vanilla comes from the vanilla bean. Did you know that? Oh. Yes. And the bourbon bean. A lot of people don't know that. Oh, of course, you knew that. Well, where would vanilla? <laughs> you, knew, you knew that this was a quarter and a half pound. Of course, you know that it came from a bean. All right, next week, Were you watching yesterday no. when Tony oh, yes, asked I was. <laughs> Jim and Tammy's bodyguards about Tammy's liposuction and said, where did Tammy have her liposuction? Yes. And, and he said, in Charlotte. I'm <laughs> <laughs> reminded of that with the vanilla bean. <laughs> okay. And now we've got one 15-ounce can of garbanzo beans rinsed and drained. Now, as I said before, beans are the beans are high in fiber. Mm -hmm. And I use them as an extender, like they're like hamburger helper for fudge. Oh, and you can throw use, it out. Yes, you can use, use even more than this. Yeah, they really do. Those they are good thicken. food. Garbanzo I, beans are good. Oh, they are the best. It's yeah. not like you're using baked beans, like kidney beans. But could we use any kind of beans? You can. But garbanzo mm -hmm. beans have like the less taste so it well I yes and I like the kind of nutty flavor they have. Oh that's true. Right. Do. Tommy, okay. Fred's walked all the way around here to keep you on to move quickly. <laughs> well we're gonna yes. move around. Garbanzo beans are the same thing or as chickpeas. Chick yeah, exactly and also in Italy they're known as chichi beans. Chichi beans. Now the first thing we do is we massage our beans. Now, put your hands in there and massage Steve. Put your hands in here Me Steve. Too? Come on let's earn that million a year. Let's go. <laughs> Come on, mash them up, mash them up. They, they don't massage but very easily. Yes. Like no, beans. you got it, Steve. No, come on, smash those oh, beans. Oh, oh, you, don't be a kitchen wimp. Get, Get in, in there. Come on, come on. All right, that's good. Now, you might not know, but these come from the 1400s. That's where they originated. These feel the, like they came from the 1400s. <laughs> no, they originated. They were fossilized. <laughs> they we were, did this in Lebanon. We yes. squeezed our beans, I think. <laughs> that's well, how then, we met. Then you know that these were used as an yes. aphrodisiac. That's how they, we met. They, <laughs> these are aphrodisiacs? Yes, Bruce Hershenson told me. <laughs> no, actually. For Bruce, no, can I tell you an the truth? I'll tell you the truth. I've got some, some proof right here. National Review. This is from... <laughs> This is from Best oh, Ways Magazine. Shake. Did you use like a utensil for this no. instead of your hands? Yes, but I'm afraid of electricity. So I, I just like to smash them up. But anyway, Sheikh Umar Abu Muhammad says that huh? these were used God as aphrodisiacs. Absolutely. Yes. Well, now let me tell you what we need to do here. Now, while you're finishing oh, no, those no. beans up, what you want to do is you want to go them. ahead yeah. and get those hands in there until I uh, tell you. Sorry. All right, now you go ahead and you melt down your butter and your chocolate like I've already done here. Mm. All right, doesn't that look good? Look at that just boiling right mm. up there. Mmm. Okay, now when you're done, you just add all the rest of the ingredients. Mm. All right, and I'm, I'm just going to eyeball this. I'm going to put in a teaspoon. Eyeball, okay, a teaspoon of vanilla. All right. All right. All right, mm -hmm. then we just mix that up there and we add our beans. Go ahead, Steve, help me out here. What? Well, what do you want me to do? The smush. What do you want from Oh, me? here. Um, go ahead. <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> okay. Bring back the elephant. Then you just put in your sugar. Bring me the sugar. It all goes in here. I Look how simple and easy this is, huh? All that sugar in there. Look oh, at this merciful sugar. heaven. Yes, yes. Doesn't that look good? Did we just say this put was good that in there. Oh. Put the sugar in. And it's all you do is you just mix this up. Oh, oh. you just. <laughs> You just, you go, something, well, don't give me a spoon like this. Look, oh. look at this thing. Tommy, <laughs> I need a big spoon. All right, are we show. out of time, Fred? 
30 seconds. Oh, okay. Anyway, all right, we don't have time to finish. Just get your butter cookie sheet like this. I'll go to commercial. We'll finish it here. All right. We're going to give you the proper. We have to do this after the commercial, too. We'll be right back with the Bean Gourmet and Stephen Tawny. Okay. Tomorrow, Ron Lisko. Tell me. Longest cooking segment this is in history. impossible to stir. I know, you don't I know. have enough liquid. You, you know, in no, here. no, there's enough liquid. Oh, believe me, there's enough liquid. It's all we need is an electric mixer. Trust mm -hmm. me, I've done this before. All of this powder is going to go in with the. Yes, believe me, it does. And it comes down to looking Tommy, just like Tommy, this. Yes, Steve. This is disgusting. No, can I tell you? Can <laughs> I, 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 this looks like refried beans. Don't, don't let my skill um, you know, deter any of you from trying this, okay? <laughs> because this really is delicious okay. stuff. Right. Now, what we do next is we take our pan here, a small, shallow cookie sheet, mm -hmm. like that. That, and we just butter it up, okay? Now all we do is we pour this. Help me lift this. It's a little heavy. Sure, oh, yeah. Jeez. Help me lift this. Use a clean spoon. Don't, you know, yeah. don't use something like this. Anyway, you just simply pour it into the pan like this. That's not exactly pouring it. Oh. That's like <laughs> glopping, glopping, glopping it. It's glopping. You glob it onto yeah. the oh, I have never like... been so hurt in my life. <laughs> I... I... This is the last time I am doing a cooking segment on your show. <laughs> Thank goodness. No. Of course, yes, America is telling me how to do this. Right. You know what? It actually smells very good. It, it smells smell like good. fudge. Now, you it know, smells beans... like it doesn't look like it right no. now, but it smells now, like Now, beans fudge. have been given a bad name, right? We all know why. All right? Why? Well, in the bean world, we call... Well, well, we call it flatulation. It's another word for gas. No, not flatulation. What? Not flatulation. What is it? Flatulence. Flatulence. Thank you, Mike Wallace. <laughs> now, what, what happens is it can strike at any time. You know that. You've anchored in the news there. All of a sudden, you know. So what you do is you soak your beans, but when you cook them, you cook them in not the same water. You cook them in fresh water. That Did you soak these? No, these came out of these a can. These out of a can. Can you don't have to worry about. Also, can you... beans don't give you that? No, can beans don't. What you should do, they will, but what you got to do is gradually introduce them into your diet. Tommy. This is a very serious tip. Once you yes. introduce them in, you'll be fine. After a couple of weeks. After a couple of weeks, you should exactly so, Wait, wait, wait. Yes. Cook them in water that's not the same water they're soaked in. That's that exactly right. So the stuff that makes you have that problem is in the water? No, it, no it's in the no. beans. But I know, but it goes from the beans into the water. water. So dump that water out and cook it in fresh water. Does that work with broccoli and cauliflower and stuff like that? You shouldn't have a problem with that. I hate this that. discussion. <laughs> I hate this discussion. Anyway, all we do is we, we refrigerate that for an hour, and once it's hard, we taste. Okay, wait. No, wait a minute. Come out of here. Audience, you've been sitting wait, here. Wait, 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 wait. Save some for JJ. Oh, well, save there. some for JJ. Okay. Save some for JJ. <laughs> <laughs> Who wants to taste this? All right, here. Come on, everyone wants right. to jump in. Come on, Come on. grab that. Grab oh, it. No, Isn't it delicious? Don't fall. Don't fall. Yes. Please. Yes. Taste yes. Yes. it, Tony. Tell us yes. how good it tastes. Oh, I suppose so. What? Let me taste. Nobody's Isn't watching, are they? Um, is that good? Yes. 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 Y